And with that thumbs up, we start the next to last match in three, two, one, go. Right off the bat, we see three Red Alliance robots crossing the half line. Doodlebots of the Blue Alliance crosses from level two for six points for our Blue Alliance. Already in the sandstorm, Wildstang trying to place a hatch panel on the upper level of the Red Alliance rocket. They are able to place that hatch panel, but it is pretty precarious. We will have to see if that hatch panel can prevent cargo from falling out of the Red Alliance rocket. Red Alliance with an early four point lead, but with just about two minutes to go in the match, there's still plenty of game to be played. Over on the Red Alliance, we see Core 2062 trying to get some cargo in that upper level. However, a well-timed hit from Doodlebox prevents that cargo from making it into the rocket. Doodlebox playing defense against the Red Alliance, getting in the way of Wild Sting and Core 2062. Their defense does seem to be working. Wild Sting and Core 2062 are struggling to work together well. Core 2062 still struggling to line up to place cargo in the rocket because of the efforts of Doodlebox. Over on our blue line, Seabots trying to line up to place a hatch panel onto the cargo ship. They are able to make it. That's going to be two points for the Blue Alliance and the opportunity to score three more. It looks like Wild Sting and Core 2062 may have found a way to prevent them from being affected by the defense of Doodlebox. They put hatch panels on both of the middle bays of their Red Alliance rocket, and Wild Sting is able to get some cargo in for three points. Core 262 switching strategy, now placing cargo into the cargo ship. With them, the Mavericks doing the same thing, placing cargo into the cargo ship. However, they're able to grab some off the ground, saving time, not have to go back to the loading station. In it goes, thanks to the Mavericks, for another three points for our Red Alliance. Red Alliance in the lead with 50 points, with 12 seconds remaining in our match. Seven seconds to go. We are seeing the Mavericks on level one. Wild Sting trying to get to level two. At the end of our match, two Blue Alliance bots on the HAB platform. Screen a Red Alliance win. They take it home 56 points to 33. And luckily for Team 111, they are pulled to that number eight spot. Let's see if they hang on to it in our final qualification.